Everyone continues to ask me one question. What exactly happened to my career? It all started when I reached the main roster in the WWE. I became the fastest rising star on Raw and faced off every week against the biggest and best superstars of today and even led my own team to victory at Survivor Series. I faced The Undertaker at Hell in a Cell and even became WWE Champion. I headlined the top shows and main evented the biggest matches that year and even saw dream matches come alive. And when I rose too far, everything was taken from me. All there is left now is to regain what I lost. There he goes, NXT Champion. You ready for your big match tonight? What's up, everybody? Welcome to NXT TakeOver New Orleans. We are live, guys, tonight. Johnny Gargano defended his North American title against Dexter Loomis. And when I say that this was a match of the year candidate, talk about it. Dexter Loomis and Johnny Gargano went toe to toe, but it was too big of a difference in the abilities of Dexter Loomis and the heart of Johnny Gargano. And in the end, Right here, look at this big move. Bang! Connects. Good night, Johnny. The pin was one, two, three. And it was over. And now we have a new champion. But that wasn't the only champion we saw tonight because the Dusty Rose Tag Team Classic Finals were tonight as Orkin and Birch put their titles on the line against the tournament winners the wild samoans and these men went after it and put it all on the line but in the end after the beating after the brawling after the toe-to-toe -to -toe combat orkin and birch would be highly disappointed because the wild samoans walked away the new tag team champions what a great night this has been, guys. And let me tell you, the night is not over as Finn Balor defends his title against Walter. All right, guys, and here we are in the uh, main event. Finn Balor getting ready to defend his title against Walter. The final one-on-one -on -one match between these two. About time we get a, a, a title match in the picture, and I'm sure Walter is as ready as Finn Balor is. And here comes the NXT champion, Finn Balor. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Vincent Blaze interfering in this matchup. Oh, my goodness. That elbow to the face, and they're throwing Balor. Into the LED screen. For the love of God. What is wrong with this man? And you see Finn Balor now running. Trying to get to the ring. Trying to get some distance between him and Blaze. And now Finn Balor fighting back. The reversal by Blaze. And oh my goodness that right hook just put that man's chin up for sale. And now look at this. Blaze going for the most electrifying moon salt. Oh my goodness. And this was supposed to be a championship match between Walter and Finn Balor. And, and, and look at this, Blaze. Sticking his nose in someone's business that isn't his own. Attacking the champion. And Blaze said this weeks ago, he said and he is going to raise as much trouble and chaos as he can 
to get Triple H's attention for demoting him back down to NXT. But this is ridiculous. This is a title match. And you can't, oh my goodness, train of thought. I am just sickened right now. I am sick. This does not make any sense in the face the facts follows up behind. And the ref has to get in there. The ref has to stop this. This has gone too far. This is ridiculous. Mick Foley has to get this man under control. There's no reason he should be doing this. You got it. You tell me when you want me to get you a main event. I got you, Mick. And guys, we are back. We've been informed that Mick Foley has required a reset of a main event. And instead of our title match as programmed, we are now getting a one-on-one -on -one non-title no match between match. Finn Balor his way to the and Vincent Blaze. And you gotta believe me when I tell you this. Pounds. Finn Vincent Balor probably Icon could not be Blaze. any happier than right now to get his hands on Vincent Blaze. Blaze has just turned into a different man. We have not seen a side of him like this before. Listen, this man led a survivor's team to victory and became WWE champion, a fast rising superstar. This right here is out of line, out of character. And here comes Balor. And you know, in the back of Balor's mind, he has to be wondering what exactly has he done to bring on the all of this trouble on himself because Finn Balor has done nothing but be an upstanding champion an upstanding superstar and role model tonight he needs to put Blaze in his place and chin check him alright guys it's Blaze one on one with the champ Finn Balor the ref ringing the bell and these two are now going to go after it. Blaze got himself in this predicament. He's going to have to get himself out because Finn Balor is going to come at him with a handful of steam and hands full of fury. Oh, and that strong kick to the back. And of course, Finn Balor going right after Blaze. Sling Blade. And Blaze deserves every bit of this beating as he is getting in a little extra. It does not make any sense why Blaze has taken this demotion to NXT. So, so I don't see it as a demotion, first off. Blaze was one of the best superstars in NXT when he was here. Of course, he got let go. We recognize that. He was fired. He was let go. The WWE didn't have anything for him. He was released. He made his way to New Mexico. He made his way to Japan. It brought him back here in the WWE. And yes, Triple H, there is no denying it. Triple H has screwed Blaze over. And sending him down to NXT was a way of trying to, to shut the mouth on the most biggest superstar in the business right now. But. Blaze should not be taking it out on his fellow superstars and trying to sabotage every little thing that's happening here in NXT because he's unhappy. And look at this big elbow. And I'm not sure if it connected or if the elbow just took a lot of floor. And Blaze beating the ever-living mess out of Finn Balor. And these two are brawling on the outside of the ring. And remember, this is a no holds bar match. Oh, my goodness. So there is no count out, no disqualification. Mick Foley wants 
Finn Balor to capitalize on every ounce of punishment he can put on Vince. But the bad part about it is that that's a two-way street because Blaze can do the same thing to him. And Blaze with a right hook, putting a combination together like a Chinese restaurant. And now look at this. This man then grabbed a chair and oh my goodness. One shot to the chrome on oh, another. Shot to the gutter. Oh, he tried to go for it back. And my goodness, and I own oh, Pele King. And now look at Blaze. Look at this. Oh my goodness, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. And this crowd is booing as Blaze. Oh, look at this with mist in his eyes. Oh, my God. And this crowd chant, and this is awesome. And they all might need to get their brains examined. There is nothing exciting or awesome about Finn Balor's situation as Blaze sprayed green mist in his face, in his eyes, using it to temporarily blind the man and take full advantage of putting him through the barricade. Finn Balor is in trouble. Finn Balor back to his feet, trying to go make something happen, but Blaze is still in control off the ropes. Bam! Elbow drop and Finn Balor has to fight back because he is in some serious trouble after that spray miss to the face DDT. Oh, look at this. Finn Balor. He has Blaze in a nice predicament to set him up for the cool day ground. And the pin, it can be over. One, two, three. Oh, my goodness. I thought he had him. I thought he had him. And what a main event we have here tonight. I'm not sure if this is a, if, if the Wonder match would have been better, but my goodness, this is good. One, two, on oh, another kick out before three. And this crowd chanting NXT because there is no place you rather be the reversal by blaze face the facts out of nowhere good night america one two three and blaze walks away victorious despite all the boos from the crowd and blaze picks up a huge victory over the champion and you got to want to wait, wait a minute, wait a minute! And Blaze disrespectfully going after the champion after the match is over. This is ridiculous. Mick Foley has to control this man. He's lost his mind.